Welcome back to the second episode of ITTF High Performance and Development Weekly Training Lessons. Also this time we have prepared for you some special weapons and tactics. Today's topic is a player's chess move, an action which can predict the opponent's move. Table tennis is often compared to chess, but with high speed. That's why we call this action a chess move. It is an action made by one player which generates an expected action from the opponent. Top players are able to prepare for several options, then choose and play the one that will give them the best chance at winning the point. Let's see how some top players use a chess move. The main objective of this plan is to force an opponent to do exactly what you expect. A topspin opening, a backhand flick, a backhand push, and many more. We will see how effective this can be. At the Seamaster 2019 ITTF Australian Open, Patrick Franziska from Germany perfectly planned a super speed backhand block after his Chinese opponent Xu Xin made a topspin opening. Xu Xin opened confidently, but Franziska was expecting that by preparing an effective and winning backhand speed block. Let's go into details. Returning the serve, Xu anticipated a short serve and made his approach towards the net. Here's the chess move. Franziska intentionally played a half-long sidespin serve, anticipating receiving a cross-court topspin opening from Xu. The German prepared his backhand and made a tremendous acceleration for his backhand block with a low trajectory of the racket and forearm. After that speedy ball, Xu could only try to touch the ball without success. Let's watch it again. At the Seamaster 2019 ITTF Hong Kong Open, Mima Ito from Japan forced Austrian Sofia Polkandova to perform an apparently inviting backhand flick. Ito predicted that move and played her typical shot, a powerful forehand smash. Let's go into details. Ito made her serve, with two elements clear to Polkanova, the side spin, the backhand shot placement. Polkanova could not miss that opportunity to take initiative by opening with a backhand flick, but had to place it on Ito's forehand, exactly where the Japanese was waiting for the ball. At this point, Mima was very well positioned, ready to explode her smash with a high racket and open wrist. Let's move to our animated table. The objective of today is to create a situation where you can easily predict an action from your partner. Taking the example of before, let's try to do some repetitions. Carry out a half-long serve with a heavy side backspin. Request your partner to make an opening topspin and prepare a speed backhand block cross court or even down the line. Serve short with side topspin on forehand or backhand and ask your partner to flick to the forehand. By the time you serve, you move slightly to the right to cover the forehand corner. Serve short with a heavy side backspin on a wide backhand and ask your partner to push. As your partner returns, move to the left with a pivot action and prepare a finishing speed forehand. We hope you have enjoyed today's SWAT and see you soon for the next ITTF High Performance and Development Weekly Training Lessons.